I'm going to do an exercise for Wright Patterson Mahjong using the Green Book from 2020. This exercise is called Charleston Sprints. The purpose is to practice quick decision making. This is a great idea if you ever want to play in a tournament or maybe play online where you have to make quick decisions because you're on a timer. Eight seconds. Most times you have to make decisions in eight seconds. That's pretty quick. That's why I like to practice. If you're new to Mahjong or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. I have my smartphone here with a stopwatch app. We're going to do three laps. Laps one, three, and five will be the sprints. Laps two and four will be set up. We're going to draw cards to determine which player we are and which seat is prevailing. That'll just keep it random. We're going to be east for the first one and west is prevailing. I will create a random pull with 14 tiles and then I'll create a mock Charleston. We have three of each tile, no, four, four, three. Mix suits, two, four, seven, five, six, eight, nine, five, six, seven. I think I would play mix suits, six, seven, eight, nine. Six, seven, eight, nine, maybe with wins, we have Chinese takeout. So fives can go. We need a pair of sixes maybe. So let's pass these three. No keepers. Let's see, let's pass a four. We got a six. We need a pair in there. Let's pass these three. We got a keeper. Let's lap. Okay, six, seven, eight, nine. Six pair, seven, seven, eight, seven, eight, six. Really, we don't need that. I'm thinking big chows. Seven, eight, nine in each suit. Seven, eight, nine mixed. That would be for this one. So if we play big chows there, or we could maybe play the Chinese takeout. Chow main. Seven, eight, nine in each suit with news and one win paired. So that's really four discards with an option. If you would have done something different with these tiles, write it in the comment section below with sprint one. We're going to be west for the next one and east is prevailing. We didn't use prevailing or our seat for this hand, but we might for the next one. We have mixed suits. Four, five, three, four, five, six. Four, five, six. Four, five, six would be middle chows. What is going on with chows? We have dragons. Let's let the nine go and maybe, maybe play four, five, six. Maybe this two can go. Let's see, maybe the dragon and keep dots. Okay, let's pass these. Whoa, four, five, six. 
Do you need pairs of, let's see, middle chows, pairs of threes. We have pairs of twos. Here's a three. Three, two. Oh my goodness. Three. We have a three there. Let's let that go. Let's let that go. Seven. Let's let that go. Maybe we can switch to cracks. Four. That would be a keeper. Four, five, six. Let's let these go. We want four, five, six. No keepers. Lap. Okay, so we have sevens and four, five, six. We don't need twos. Pair of threes. Four, five, six with a pair of threes. Or four, five, six with news. Mix suits again. But we could maybe keep cracks as an option if they come in and focus on one suit and honors. So I would start by discarding those. Middle chows. We keep getting mixed suits. It's a good category to focus on. There are a lot of tiles you can work or a lot of hands you could play, but boy, the picking or the, the passes are really challenging. Hmm. We have all the fours. All right. If you would have done something differently with these tiles, write it in the comment section below with Sprint 2. going to be south. North is prevailing. So we'll get 13 tiles. We have a predominant pattern this time with BAMs. Three, six, nine there. Three, four, four, three. Let's see, two, four, eight, four, three, nine. I was thinking maybe a hopscotch hand, scotch hopper. Let's let a dragon go. So BAMs or mixed suit. We have dots. Well, here's a one crack. So one, three, four, two, three, two, two, four, eight, nine, four odds, heavenly hopscotch. So let's let a wind go. Oh boy. A nine, a six and a seven. No, that's not helpful. Oh my goodness. This is terrible. Okay. Let's let the four go. Bams. Thank goodness. Lap. Oh my. <laughs> that was really challenging. Okay, so I think I would focus on one suit and honors. So we have two pair, maybe razzle. Really, this wouldn't be useful if we play razzle. But if we get more bams, we could maybe play shamrock. So I think I would keep that. If you would have done something different with these tiles, write it in the comment section below with Sprint 3. Wright Patterson Mahjong will soon be available to play at Mahjong time. When that happens, we'll be able to play at tables with most likely eight seconds to make decisions. Between now and then, Get your tiles out and practice with Charleston Sprints. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up 
If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.